Hey there folks, Root Beer here with question number three on the 2003 Grade 8 Gauss. Created by the University of Waterloo, those fine folks down there at the CEMC. At a school fundraiser, $3,109 was raised. The money was shared equally among 25 charities. The amount received by each charity from the school was... Hmm, okay. Well... All, it's really, all we really need to do here is divide this money up by amongst 25 charities. Now, you can notice pretty quickly this number isn't going to end, doesn't end in a 25, 50, 75, or double zero. So it's not going to divide evenly. And our answers do reflect that. But there's nothing else to do except just divide this uh, 3,109 by 25. Do it however you need to. If you want to grab your calculator, go right ahead. Or we can do it by hand, and that's what I'm about to do. Because I like to show my work to you guys. So the, the units doesn't matter. We're still going to have dollars in the end. So really what we want to find out is this. We want to do this long division. And it's okay to go into decimals because uh, the Canadian dollar, if you don't know, is uh, decimal as well. So there's in one dollar there are a hundred cents. So we really can go, uh, we'll, we'll go all the way down to two decimal places and that will give us the cents. Okay. So, not everyone who writes this contest is from Canada or America, where we break it down into cents. Some places, I believe, do have other things, and you got to be aware of that. So 25 doesn't go into 3 any times, but 25 goes into 31 once. So 1 times 25, we have 25 here. 31 minus 25 is 6, and we bring down the 0. Now 25 goes into 60 twice, so you can have 50. So 50 here. Now we bring down the 10. And I'm just going to stop for a moment and check our answers. Do any of them start with 1, 2? Uh, yeah, 1, 2, 4. Or 1, 2.7. So I think it's going to be E or A. I'm pretty sure it's going to be E. Because if we take a look, we've got 1 in our hundreds digit. But let's continue on with the question as normal and make sure that all of their answers are po or uh, any of their answers are possible. So 109. How many times does 25 go into 109? Well, four times. 25 goes into 100 exactly four times. So we subtract. We get that nine. And now we go into our decimals. We bring down the zero. How many times does 25 go into 90? Uh, the best we can get is 75, so that's three times. And that leaves us with 15 here, and then we take another zero, bring it down, and 150, well, 50 goes into 153 times, and 25 goes into 50 twice, so we're going to get a six here. And that is going to be an even division. So each charity... Got $124.36, and that was, what was it, E or was it A? I can't remember. E. Okay. Not bad. Uh, it's been a while since I had to do long division. Of course, if you used your calculator, and you got to remember calculators are allowed, if you did use your calculator because you remembered to bring it, that question probably took seconds. Just uh, 3,109 divided by 25. Find your answer listed below. Okay. So we're going to take a look at question number four now. So join me for that. 